Hey, Tony here. For today's Slipcover Saturday, I'm gonna show you my four film favorites with slipcovers. Um, some of these were Best Buy exclusives that featured a theme for each one. So first up, we have the Batman Collection, which has um, Batman 1989, Batman Returns, Batman Forever, and Batman and Robin. And as you can see, it does have the Best Buy exclusive sticker on it. And then next up, we have the Dirty Harry collection with Dirty Harry, Magnum Force, The Enforcer, and Sudden Impact. We also have the Sci-Fi Action collection with I Am Legend, V for Vendetta, Blade, and Constantine. Okay, we also have Family Adventures, which has Legends of the Guardians, Where the Wild Things Are, Yogi Bear, and Space Jam. And then we got the Lethal Weapon Collection with all four Lethal Weapon films. We got the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Collection with the three Turtles films and the TMNT um, animated movie. And then we got the Gritty Thrillers with Unknown, Edge of Darkness, Seven, and Training Day. And then we also got the Modern Comedies with Wedding Crashers, Horrible Bosses, um, Hall Pass, and Dumb and Dumber. So what I liked about these was the fact that you could purchase these without having to have all the individual sets on the shelf. So it did kind of save space. So if you think about four films in one package instead of four separate films, you know, you would save three spaces per release, which was great. So really nice looking sets. Please leave me a comment below. Let me know if you ever picked these up um, and what you thought about them. And let me know if you like the multi-packs as I do. Um, anything to save on space is always a great thing. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I really appreciate it if you would subscribe. If you do subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and on TikTok. And if you'd like to find out what I've been watching, you can find me over on Letterboxd. I do have links below. But thanks again for watching, and we will see you next time.